Hello, Dutch traders. You are watching Economic News with me, Dachmina Salomova. Traders rushed to sell the American currency after the United States released disappointing macroeconomic statistics. Reportedly, the U.S. retail sales volume increased by just 0.1 percent in September, matching the pace of growth seen in the previous month. The retail sector is the main contributor to the overall economic growth in the country. The latest result was much worse than expected. Experts predicted that the retail sales would grow by 0.7 percent. On the other hand, the U.S. manufacturing report turned to be more optimistic. The Empire State Manufacturing Index, compiled by the Federal Reserve Bank of New York, came in at 21.1 points, exceeding market expectations that called for rise to 20.4 points. However, the U.S. dollar index pulled back to Friday's lows as the opening of the American trading session. The U.S. index got back to the level of 95.00. The demand for the American currency decreased as Donald Trump continues his struggle with China. The U.S. president is planning to introduce a new round of tariffs on Chinese goods. Meanwhile, the single European currency benefited from the greenback's weakness and approached the level of 1.16.00. Tuesday is a busy day for traders as a slew of important macroeconomic data is scheduled for release during the Asian session. In particular, China and New Zealand will unveil the inflation report, while the Reserve Bank of Australia will publish the minutes of its latest monetary policy meeting. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. We wish you profitable deals and see you tomorrow.